Hello and welcome to the calculator guide video on finding the volume of similar cylinders. Here we have our question. Cylinders E and F are similar. So essentially, one cylinder is an enlarged version of the other cylinder. Now the volume of cylinder E is given as 450 centimetres cubed, and we need to calculate the volume of cylinder F. So as I mentioned before, cylinder F is an enlargement of cylinder E. So we need to find the scale factor, and we're given a comparison of the two heights of the cylinder. E is 12 centimetres high, and F is 15 centimetres high and from that we can work out the scale factor for the height of the cylinders. Use the fraction button and you want to put the height of the enlarged shape as your numerator. Now I've put enlarged in inverted commas here because it may be that the enlarged shape is smaller. If you have a scale factor that is between 0 and 1, say for example a half, then you're going to have a cylinder which is half the height but we'd still describe that as being an enlargement, so we have to be careful here. The denominator should be the height of the original shape, or the height that you've essentially been given the volume of in the question, so in this case, cylinder E. So we're gonna have 15 on the top and 12 on the bottom. So we have a scale factor of five over four, five quarters, or we'll use it in decimal form, 1.25. That scale factor of 1.25 is just for one dimension, so it's just for the height of the cylinders. Now we have a three-dimensional shape here. So whilst cylinder F is 1.25 times taller or higher than cylinder E, it is also 1.25 times wider, if you like, and 1.25 times deeper, or the dimension that would appear to be going in and out of the screen. So 1.25 times 1.25 times 1.25. So the volume of enlarged cylinder F is going to be 1.25 cubed times the volume of cylinder E. And if we just check, we've got a three dimensional shape. Check the units, well the units are in centimeters cubed. So we'd expect the scale factor to be a cubic scale factor for this particular enlargement. So using the calculator, we're going to input 1.25 cubed. The cube function is accessed by pressing shift and x squared. You'll see a little yellow x cubed in the top left hand corner. And then we're going to multiply that by the volume of cylinder E, which is 450. And here we have our answer. I'm going to round that to one decimal place, 878.9 centimeters cubed for the volume of cylinder F. So there we go, how we can work out the volume of an enlarged cylinder, given that we have one dimension that we can compare from both cylinders. But that's it for this video. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time on The Calculator Guide.